scheduled for one fall. It is for the PWI Heavyweight Championship. Ladies and gentlemen, from Japan, weighing in at 220 pounds, the Shadow Ninja number two. Fans, here we are, the feature match of today. We have the Shadow Ninja, number two, going in the ring to try and wrest the belt away from the PWI heavyweight champion, Bobo Brazil Jr. There you see him flying the war flag, the battle flag of the Far East. The Shadow Ninja, number two, will face the current and PWI Heavyweight champion. We'll the listen to Richard PWI introduce. champion, weighing in at 260 pounds, from Benton Harbor, Michigan, ladies and gentlemen, Bobo Brazil Jr. Bobo Brazil Jr., the PWI Heavyweight Champion, making his way to the ring for another title defense against Shadow Ninja number two. Fans on their feet here at ringside awaiting the emergence of the champion, Bobo Brazil Jr. And um, as you notice, the air is cleared here to my side here um, in more ways than one. Dallas James said he had some business to attend to in the back. So it looks like I'll be going it alone, finally. Here on Wrestling Fever today as we show you this feature match. We've had a lot of great matches already today. A great wrestling classic that you got to see. And now, the title defense of Bobo Brazil Jr. And here he is, making his way to the ring. And there you see the Shadow Ninja aggressively waiting to meet the crown champion here at the PWI. Accompanying Bobo to ringside is his personal bodyguard, Nelson. Finally there to ringside. And Bobo, though he can take care of himself in the ring, we've seen it many times in the past, many vicious attacks, many of the masked, uh, masked assailant attacks here inside, outside the ring. Bobo, it's not enough that he has to worry about defending his, his title in the ring. He's also got to watch his back inside the ring, outside, around the ring, entering out. Man, not... Not as glorious a life as one would be led to believe when you're holding the title here in the PWI, everyone is out after you. Everyone is looking for that title shot. And you had better be able to defend yourself both inside and outside. And he's, he's picked him up. Nelson here just to give him, try and give him that edge so he can get into the ring without having to worry about anything else and keeping his mind directly on his match. And right there, he's showing his strength, showing the power of the big man, the kingpin here in the PWI, Bobo Brazil Jr. And there against the martial arts expert from the Far East, Shadow Ninja number two. Referees hold as the ninja moves him back into the corner. Referee, call him for a break. And there he goes with the karate chop to the chest and then judo across the forehead, but he's attacking the wrong part of the body on Bobo Brazil and he delivers one of the patented headbutts here. And the Shadow Ninja number two goes reeling to the outside. And the professor calling for the referee to check to see what's inside the forehead of Bobo Brazil Jr. Fans, we all know what a hard head the champion has, and he used it much to his advantage, just as his legendary father has before in the ring. Bobo Brazil Jr. has got one powerful headbutt. Again, the two wrestlers meet up. Ninja takes him back into the turnbuckle. Referee counts it out, and a judo chop across the throat of Bobo. Whips him into the turnbuckle, misses, and Quick package there by Bobo Brazil, not quick enough though. Fast to foot, the ninja. 
Making his move and quickly moving to the outside. Bobo Brazil showing both speed and power right here in the opening moments of this title defense here. Shadow Ninja showing some effects. Quick move, beautiful move there. Leg trip by Bobo Brazil Jr. Showing he has both power and scientific ability. Well trained and one should be coming from the family of the legendary father of his, Bobo Brazil. But now Bobo Brazil Jr. has picked up and moved on in his own right. Does not have to feel he is in the shadow, although it'd be hard to get out of, of his legendary father. But he has earned the right and the respect by capturing the title here in the PWI and has maintained successful defenses despite the many vicious attacks inside and outside the ring. Who's behind it? Well, we hope that this soon will end. And with the menacing surroundings, he is forced to wrestle in right now with the four aces, the professor, Johnny Lee. It's anything that this man can keep his mind in this match against this top contender. But Bobo Brazil has gained the upper, upper control here up, has maintained the leverage even with what has transpired on the outside. You know, Bobo definitely with looks of concern. <laughs> with, you know, uh, right now I'm sure he wish he could have a, a set of eyes in the back of his head because he is definitely concerned with what he's seen surrounding the ring here. Somewhat confusing as you've seen, you know, this new female face, Johnny Lee out there, the four aces and gentleman Johnny Lee. I think, I think if, if Bobo had not seen it, I, I do believe he could have finished this match at this point. He's definitely in control here. I'm sure he could have finished this match with the Shadow Ninja had not this distraction on the outside appeared to him during this title defense. But right now, it looks like he's regrouped and got his senses within him. The air is kind of cleared out from ringside here. Well, you know, the ref referee is still being distracted. Bobo Brazil Jr. still distracted. And there you saw him caught off guard as the professor getting in the way. Series of blows there by the Shadow Ninja again aggressively attacks with the martial arts, and there you see him. There you see him, Johnny Lee, three of his aces, and this, this has gotta be this Lady Luck that we were talking about, that we heard about earlier. This has gotta be her. But there you see, there you see the champion. I think he's ready. It looks like he is ready to bring it in to the distractions and put this title defense to rest. So I think he's ready to set things straight with the ninja. Beautiful belly to belly suplex. Takes him over there. Almost a three count. Did not quite get him down there. But I think Bobo is ready to take control. After all those distractions, and delivering the weapon, the weapon of choice of Bobo Brazil Jr. The patented headbutt, the flying headbutt there. I don't see how the ninja's gonna get out of that one. He's got the leg, the he's winner got the three count. Still champion, he has got Bobo the title. And he delivers Brazil one on the professor. Jr. I'd like to see him line up the four aces and him deliver right there. And here Nelson back in with the goal.